today we are casting for K-pop. We're looking for undiscovered talent. We're looking for our next great K-pop stars for K-pop the musical. We want to put people on stage that are incredibly talented and do the genre justice. I'm from Philly and uh, drove up for this. Getting to just be here and like audition for this show is like maybe I can do this. There's not a lot of shows for Asian people. You know, when you're an Asian kid growing up, you have Mulan and that's it. This production is going to be more than just a musical about K-pop. It's going to be where Korean kids see themselves. And God, I want to be a part of that. So the musical tracks the journey of three main artists, all under a fictional label called RBY Entertainment. The label consists of a boy band, a girl group, and a solo star. They're filming a documentary about uh, their label and all of their incredible artists. It's a story of a monolithic industry and the pressures that it creates and the overwhelming sensation of wanting to be perfect and how it's both a gift and could be also a curse. It is an opportunity to really uh, express the complex human nature of Asian characters. All of the complex, flawed, yet beautiful, you know, um, insides of these people. Idols train for so long and so hard and there's so much work put into it. The life of a K-pop idol can easily be translated to stage because I think it's meant to be showy, which I think is also kind of the appeal of Broadway too. This, you know, genre of music from our like homeland is making such a like impact on a global scale. It's not just for Koreans anymore. It's not just for people in East Asia. I think it's just very beneficial to come to Broadway and really put um, the Asian experience on the map for the world to see. I remember during the last production at Ars Nova, on closing night, looking over and seeing this little Korean girl who must have been five or six years old watching the show. <laughs> and she was looking at these performers like, oh my God, I've never seen people like this before. And I never had that growing up here. And so I really want to write the show for that little girl, uh, for that little boy.